morning we're in Changsha. It's going to be a very long day. We had to fly from Xiamen to Changsha. And we're just going to be touring the city for the day to waste time because our ultimate destination tonight is the first national park of China, Zhangjiajie. In the meantime, yay, I said the word. In the meantime, we're going into the Hunan Museum, which is very popular, known throughout China. All museums in China are free, so as a result, we have thousands of people come here every single day. Our guide is going to see what he can do by showing our passports and our ongoing plane ticket that leaves at 6.30 tonight. It's great to be a foreigner sometime. They gave us a pass and they let us walk through. I was just directed to the ladies' waiting line to go through security. The short version is they were building an underground hospital, excavating, and they discovered these tombs from the Western Han Dynasty at, how do you say that? Mawang... Mawang Dui. Mawang Dui. Ma They're from 2100 years ago. All these relics. Okay, there were three tombs. The bronze shields proved who the owner was of the tomb and who they were unearthing. These are just some of the very many objects found in the tombs. Weapons, including what's left of his bows, arrow, quiver. Well, they also found some fruits intact and stones and seeds of some of the others, like plums and dates and plum stones. Gorgeous jars. I like that. They even unearthed some sediment of liquor. And just like the Egyptians, they buried food with for use after death. Yes. Bamboo case containing eggshells, duck bones. Now we know what a swan <laughs> skeleton looks like. I don't know if you can see this well, but they also found 300 wooden images buried. Um, images of all the servants. Because of course you needed your servants in the afterlife. I'm going to keep repeating this, but keep in mind, this is all 2100 years old, all these figurines. There is no such thing as not taking your money with you when you die. They did. You may not know, I certainly didn't, that lacquer was a Chinese invention, even though everybody thinks of it as Japanese. In the Chinese dynasties, manuscripts and paintings were all put on silk. This is one of the few original silk yes. works that's left because it, nothing was preserved very well, obviously. I mean, 2100 years. The Hunan Museum also has a fantastic exhibition of ceramics. He came from tomb number nine. This pair is Tang Dynasty. The foreigner wears a handkerchief and he has a knife at his waist. If I saw this gorgeous pot in an antique store somewhere, I would think it was brand new instead of from 421 BC.